What's up, everybody? Happy Wednesday. Welcome to Joel's CoachCast, and this is episode number 10. And uh, look, we got two this week. We did one yesterday, which was an amazing one. Uh, actually, we with Alana on from 2B Mindset, and she has some great information to share about the scale and all that stuff. That's up still. Actually, it probably isn't up anymore, but it will be up on my YouTube this evening. So, uh, But then this one... I'm also, I'm excited about everyone. I can't, yeah, I'm always excited about these coach casts. And I think this has been fun because this is episode number 10, you know, which is uh, almost 10 weeks, a little bit more because we took a break over the holidays. But what I'm excited about this is because uh, with everything, this is the whole idea behind this is to help with your business as a team beach body coach. Uh, and then obviously bring in some, some aspects of it when it comes to the health and nutrition and, and everything like that. But really about the, uh, the business of it, and uh, I'm liking that people like my shirt. I thought it today it was uh, you know it was a good one to to put on. And uh, look, this so this guy uh, that I'm bringing on tonight, I've been working with him. I've worked with him before. He is out of the Beachbody Utah office, and uh, he is the senior manager for training and field development. And I was like, who better? to come on and actually talk about uh, the tools and all the new tools that are out there uh, that are coming out for your Team Beach, for, as a Team Beach Body Coach. So with that said, I'm gonna push my buttons here. I'm gonna go live, and I'm gonna push add. And then for the one and only Kevin Shaw. I'm on. But I can't hear you. Hold on. Why can't you hear you? There we are. There you are. Cool. What's up, mate? Hey. Hey. So Kevin Shaw is, that's like a cool, uh, I feel like that's a name from, isn't that like from a Fast and Furious movie? Of <laughs> like, you, like, you have the guy, you sound like maybe you should be English with an English accent and you should be like the, the bad guy, but everyone loves you. Yeah, I should be attractive also, and none of those are true. Oh, well, you know, we got lighting for that, buddy. <laughs> don't, sell yourself, <laughs> don't sell yourself short, okay? Don't you do that. You're a very attractive man, and you know it. So how you doing, hey, man? Hey. Good to see you tonight. Pretty good. Thanks for, like, for jumping on. And, uh, you know, look, uh, as I was saying right before this, you, know, you and I, we got to work together a lot with the Lift Ford launch, and we did the, you know, the touting rights, the biggest launch uh, Facebook group ever so far in beach body history you know we can both do that and uh with live for and that was awesome and you know so um and as everything that's been happening uh and look with 2019 and what we talked about right before uh, the, you know the, this year started was the fact that there were some amazing new tools coming out including the tracking sheet and the, track, the tracking document that you and kim and everybody have developed it over at the office so uh, yeah, man, thanks for coming on and really chatting about it. So I introduce you, uh, you know, so your, your title, Senior Manager of Training and Field Development. And uh, so just, you know, for, for everyone who doesn't get to see all your videos uh, and all the stuff you do on the Team Beachbody page is, you know, give a little insight of what your, you know, your daily thing, your daily tasks are and how to help the Team Beachbody Coaching Network. Absolutely. So thanks. So yeah, uh, if you don't know me, which is probably everybody, that's completely fine. Um, I do work here in the in the Provo office in Utah. Absolutely love it. And this year has been a fantastic year so far because we are changing how we do things. And Carl has told us specifically that training is a major point of emphasis for him this year and which gets me all excited. So some of the things that we've already started to implement, some of the things we're going to implement. Um, but I think as you, as you mentioned, one of the best things that we have come out with so far is this little document right here. Now, this for some for, for those who are coaches, you, you hopefully you, you've seen this. What we have, let me just give you a little background on what this is. Last the past couple of years, we have followed coaches who we call increasers. These are coaches who year over year have grown their business, even during the times when Beach Body was trying to fit, we were trying to figure out how to how to do things with bot and everything, and business wasn't going as well. These people continue to grow their business year over year. And so what we have done is we've sent them an, a, a super long survey, we've interviewed them, and we've boiled it down to what are you doing to grow your business year over year? 
And right. the result of that is right here. Nice. Nice. That's it. Hey, you know what's so cool? What's so cool about this? Because I got the sneak peek uh, last fall on this when it was in development, and you know, and I think what's so cool about this, and if people, for the people who have been watching these coach casts and anything that I've done, and what we were doing when it came to the Lift Four uh, launch group as well, was talking about consistency. You know, that question comes out. There's this question that comes up all the time from uh, from the newer coaches or the coaches who are struggling, saying how you know they they talk to they ask a top coach or anybody saying like how how did how have they gotten to that point how are they successful and it's always come back to being consistent and you know correct me if i'm wrong this tracking document does exactly that is help bring the accountability to the coach that uh, themselves on being consistent absolutely in fact what this this tracker does are, are three things number one it helps you take action now a lot of times coaches they get frozen on what to do first I, they feel like they need to have everything in place before they take action and that's completely wrong uh, because nobody likes to nobody will ever start if they're waiting for perfection so this document gets you to act and in fact we take it into segments and we give you exact minutes of how much time you should spend on each activity so that you can give an equal amount of time to each category so the first thing it does is it helps you take action and if that's that to me means everything. Number two, you mentioned it, Joel, it helps them stay consistent. People love consistency in their lives. People, just like Joel shows up on this, on Instagram with those crazy t-shirts every single time, that's consistency as expected. With the th same thing is expected with you and your business. People will follow you if you give them what they want. But if you sporadically work the business, if you sporadically do Instagram stories, if you sporadically uh, invite, there's no consistency to it. So this tracker helps you stay consistent. And while maybe the results don't come immediately, the, 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 it has been proven that the consistency in these habits will get you where you want to go. And the third thing um, is this helps you stay accountable. Absolutely helps you stay accountable to what you need to do and what you know you need to do. And I'm going to speak to that in just a little bit. But those three things is, is what this tracker is all about. Now, if you're a little bit lost on where to find this, uh, if you head over to the Beachbody Champions page, for those that are coaches, um, in the file section, the first three file section headers, there's one in English, Spanish, and French. You can go print it out, or it even works digitally. You can check it off there. That's where I would start. And Carl said he would he wants everybody to print out 52 of these and, and spiral bound it and make it so that it's something you do every single day. Yeah, and putting that and bringing that consistency into uh, the, the paper itself. So now that you look, it takes all the questions about what do I do every single day? And for someone who is a newer coach of how much, you know, there's been a lot of questions about how much time do I spend on Instagram? How much time do I spend uh, answering emails and following up, especially if considering the majority of people who are newer Beachbody coaches or, you know, the majority of team Beachbody coaches, period, this is not their only job right now. So they have a full-time job. They have a family. They have all these different things. And what I think is so amazing about this tracking sheet is it takes all that guesswork out of it. And it really puts that down onto a piece of paper. So now for those of you who are there visual, you can look at this and say, here is exactly what I need to do for how long. And you write it down. And then you can look at and look. And then when you, if you go back and look at it, like, oh, man, my business isn't doing very well. If you go back and look at it, you can see why. And, and so I think what this is, is, is amazing what you guys are doing, Kevin. So let me give you a quick example of how and, and why tracking works. And I'll use my favorite program and I'm buttering up. It's Lift 4, guys. I am my fourth round of Lift 4 right now. I am back to back to back to back. Four rounds of Lift 4. I know it doesn't show. I get that. I don't look like Joel, but I absolutely love this program. Let me you give you. You just have to wear tighter t shirts. <laughs> this is the secret, okay? It's the tighter t shirt. That's all. <laughs> um, let me give you an example. Yeah, let me give you an example of how 
tracking and being accountable has helped me with Lyft 4. In, I was blessed to be part of the pilot test group for this, and they gave us pretty much an, ex, an Excel printout tracking system that says write down your day one, week one weights. And Joel, you guys know in every single episode, he makes sure that you guys track your stinking weights. And, and you do this because not only does it help you stay accountable, but you get to see the progress. And I am and now in my fourth round of doing this. It is so fun to go back and say, oh, my gosh, I can't believe that's the weight I started with. I can't believe those how many reps I was doing. Now leading up to now where I feel accomplished. I feel like I'm doing good. Maybe in the moment. Those, those things weren't, I wasn't excited about them. Gosh, dang it, this is so hard. I don't know if I can go any heavier, but you guys know when he does this program every two weeks, you got to go up and wait. You got to go up because those stupid shoulder flies are killing me. Uh, you got to go up and wait, but that's, that's, that's what you need to do. And tracking will help you see that, okay, here's where I'm a little bit slower. Here's where I need to improve. And if I'm lacking in an area, this is where I need to focus on. So those are, that's why tracking is so important. And that's why we love, love this tracker. Yeah. And I think that's great. And it's a great, it's a great analogy, not just for using Lift 4, but for, you know, using the fact that it really is about showing your progress and showing the consistency and, and moving forward. So, uh, so Kevin, what, what, now that this sheet, now that this document is out and, and everyone's out there, yeah, Carl just, he just did on his stories, right? I think yesterday, the day before talking about, you need to print out 52 pages of this, uh, you know, or you know, three months worth or a couple months worth to, to really be able to track it and go with it. So now that this is out, what kind of trainings are you guys doing for people uh, to help them understand this and how to really get them used to this and comfortable with it? Perfect. Perfect question. Man, you teed that up so well. Um, so same thing on the Beachbody Champion page. Look, if you're a coach, go there. If you're not a coach, hey, time to become a coach. Um, in the, in the, so there's this new thing, it's fairly new to, to Facebook, and they're called Units. And so if you go to the Beachbody Champions page, if you go on the left-hand side, if you, you know, it tells you discussion, members, whatever, one of the things says units. If you click on that, we, Kim Carver, bless his heart, has interviewed everybody who is an influencer and has had them talk about each one of these sections. So there's an entire section up here, uh, a video, I think there's two or three videos there. There's like six videos right here of, the, of this section. If you go to that unit, it's labeled but the, the same thing, like connect, invite, and follow up is the name of the unit, and there's four or five videos in there. You watch these videos, they are phenomenal videos. I, guys, I'm telling you, you're hearing it straight from their mouth of what they do to stay as an, as an increaser, as an influencer. Those are where the trainings live that goes over the specifics of how to fill out the sheet and the, the best practices and the best tips for that. Nice. I love it. So, I mean, look, and, and that's the, that, again, you, utilizing technology to get the word out to the masses, which is exactly what we're doing right here, you know, utilizing uh, a newer part of Instagram of the live and then, you know, put these up on YouTube. So you guys make sure you're going to the, and the Beachbody Champions page is not a page that a lot of people know about. It's one of the, yeah. you know, oddly enough, it's one of the lesser followed Beachbody pages. But you guys, if you're a team Beachbody coach, you got to be following that page because every week, if not, it, it felt like every day Kevin's on there. Uh, but, I am. <laughs> but you're always on there doing videos and doing live sessions and uh, you know, you and I went on live when we did live for, I'm sure you and Sean uh, did some stuff for transform 20. And like, so every program that's coming out, you guys, the trainers going on with Kevin and he's bringing all of his team into this. And there's so much good information on this. And I think what is so important, not just besides the beach by live, uh, the beach by champions page, but also on the back end, you know, your, your, uh, your back office as a coach, you guys, we get so many questions as a trainer and, and Kevin, you probably get it too. And then everyone they're saying, well, I don't, I'm not a fitness professional and I don't, I've never done this before. Like, I don't know how to do this. And you guys, the information is there. You just need to know where to find it. And the beach body yeah. champions page is one of, it is a jewel. It is a crown jewel of the team beach body network. So you guys need, if you're not following one for one on Facebook after this, you need to go and follow, uh, and follow Kevin too, because he's, you know, he's always stuck in the four guys stuck in the snow up there. Uh, <laughs> so snowy over here. Yeah. So, uh, so, okay. So you got the trainings on it. Now you were talking about accountability a little while ago yeah. and what we were saying with, with, with consistency, 
uh, you know, the consistency is huge. And this document is this tracking document is massive to help people be consistent and be accountable. But accountability sometimes is hard when you're trying to hold yourself accountable. You know, you can you can kind of fool yourself sometimes. They're like, uh, you know, no one, it's, it's different. The world of entrepreneurship and being your own boss is completely different than someone else holding you accountable. So what tips can you give people uh, to, to be more accountable, better accountable? What can, what can you do to help them give some tips? Sure. But by the way, Joel, you're like the best interviewer I've ever had. This is, you are so good at this. Okay. So I, I, I know we're running close on time. I want to make sure I give you guys time to go act, but I, here's, here's, I want to leave with, with my top three tips to staying accountable. And then I want to finish with maybe a little bit of a giveaway that Joel can be involved with. So let me give you my top three tips to being accountable. So I, this year I am over the diamond group. Now, if you're a diamond coach and you had, and you had, I haven't reached out to you, you got to reach out to me on Facebook because I can get you into that group. If you don't know what a diamond coach is, Hey, time to become a coach. Um, so let me give you my top three tips on staying accountable because I have found that people kind of know what they need to do, but we can talk ourselves out of doing it so easily and it, and it, and, and it never ends well. And so in my diamond group, I'm having them stay accountable in multiple areas. And here's my top three tips that I want you guys to use and write down. And I'm, I'm actually going to use for my little giveaway. My tip number one, to stay accountable to not only your fitness, well, whatever it may be, what if it's your fitness, if it's your coaching business, if it's different aspects of your life, tip number one, tell as many people as you can. Tell people what you want to accomplish and tell them in person. Let have, If you're out to a party, let them know what your plans are. Let them know what your goals are because what they do is the next time they talk to you, they're going to say, hey, you mentioned, you talked about this, how's it going? Yeah, there's that accountability part. The more people you tell, the more people you will hold you accountable. And don't just tell your sweet granny who's not, who can let you off the hook. Tell people who are going to hold you to it. That's tip number one. Tell as many people as you can. Tip number two, make a plan. Write it down and set alarms. Make a plan because a lot of times we have good ideas up here. And all of it, but they never come to fruition. If you write down, physically write down, here's what I want to do. Here's my daily schedule. Yeah, life's going to happen. I get that. But if you write down, here's what I want to accomplish by the end of the day, it's so much more tangible. And you keep looking at it as you walk by. If you put it by your computer, you know exactly what you need to accomplish it, what you need to accomplish. And if you're, if, if time is not your friend, set alarms. If you're forgetful, if you're if life just takes over, set alarms so that you know. Okay, that alarm came off, uh, came on. I know what I need to do by this whatever time. That's no tip number two. Tip number three, and the final one. Send this tracker. Oh, let me. Say, I'll say it this way. Get an accountability friend. In, in, in other terms, we they call them accountability buddies. I don't know if that's going to catch on or not, but. <laughs> Get somebody who's going to hold you accountable and send them this sheet. So this is a Wednesday. Now, this is a Thursday to Wednesday tracker because payouts happen on that. That's just the bonus payout schedule. So the first day is Thursday. And guess what tomorrow is? Thursday. So what I want you to do is to fill this out from Thursday to next Wednesday. But you need to send that tracker to the person who's going to hold you the most accountable and, um, and, and then, and then go back and forth and say, here's what I want. Here's what I accomplished at the end of the week. Here's the lessons learned. And here's what I'm going to do because of those lessons learned. If you do those top three things, I'll say them again, tell as many people as you can make a plan, write it down and send the tracker with the results and what you're going to do about it to your accountability friend. Those three things I guys, I can promise you are going to get you further along in your goals than anything else. That's how accountability works. Yeah. The accountability and, and look, those three things are amazing, Kevin. And you know, you know, the biggest thing that I hope everyone takes away from all of this besides all, you know, besides all the amazing information is the fact that you guys, it's not going to be perfect day one it's not going to be perfect the first week you know that first sheet that you fill out of that tracker 
is going to look completely different than it will on the 52nd sheet that you fill out, or even the 22nd sheet. You have to think about you know, it, the way our bodies work, our minds work, muscle memory, kinesthetic awareness. Every time you start something new, just think about like if, you were, if you're right-handed and you started writing with your left hand, it's gonna look like crap for a long time, and you have to build up the muscle memory and the consistency of doing that. And it's the same thing with this, is it was when it comes to these new practices, it's gonna feel weird. It's the first time you do a bicep curl with weights. You hate me for forever because you have T-Rex arms, but the more you do it, the more consistent you are with it, the better it gets. It's the same thing filling this stuff out. So Kevin, that's all amazing stuff. So what's uh, so what do you what do you want to give away? What are you thinking here? Yeah. Or what do you want okay. to give away? So we had the privilege, blessing, honor of having Joel come to our office way back when, when Lift 4 came out. And what he did for us is he signed a whole bunch of t-shirts. Look at that. That's right, I did. You did. And not only was it a list four, look at this. And there's a quarter of force. That quarter that is like lim and that quarter of force, by the way, is limited edition at that point. <laughs> at this point, it really is. There's edition, only edition left. So yeah. I have five of these right here. I have five okay. signed shirts from Joel that I'm going, I want to give away to, to you guys. I have five people. I'm sure there's only five people watching. So it could be you. Um, here's what I want you to do. To, and this isn't something you need to do right now. You have a whole week to do this, but fill out this tracker to earn a chance to win a shirt. Fill out the tracker starting tomorrow, and it ends on Wednesday. On Wednesday, tag your accountability buddy. Tag me, and if you want, tag Joel. And I want, and then um, with with this. So this can be in your stories. I don't care, this can be in your post, this can be on Facebook, however you want to tag us. But with this filled out with what you how what lessons you learned during the week, and then I'll do a random drawing. Signed t-shirts from Joel. This is worth so much more money than anything else, guys. Um, these are <laughs> these are gold over here. But that's something I want you to do for you guys, just to give that little incentive to not only get to fill this out, but to find that person that's going to hold you accountable and make it public because if it's on your stories, if, if it's on your posts, you're telling more people about it. Love it, man. Hey, look, anytime you put skin in the game, especially when it includes, includes free swag, it's always going to help. So uh, we'll recap this, and, and you guys, I'll, post, uh, I'll be posting this on my stories. Uh, this part of the giveaway in the contest on my stories uh, tomorrow, so it stays up for longer. Uh, and so they've got till next Wednesday, which is the 30th, to fill this out. And then on the 30th, you want them to post this, right? On the 30th, next Wednesday. Okay, yep. there's your rules, guys. We'll post it again, because people are going to forget. You know, the minute they blink, they forget. So, Kevin, thank you so much, brother. I, I love you, man, and, and I can't wait to get back up there. I got I don't know if you saw my stories. I got my skis. I got my new skis, yeah. my Lift 4 limited edition skis that we got to come up and, and, and break in, man. Hey, I'm your skiing buddy. Don't you forget. I'm your skiing buddy. You are my skiing buddy, and, uh, you know, because I'm, we're old school. We don't snow. We're, we're, we're old That's school. Right. So, all right, Kevin, I'll talk to you soon, bro. Thanks, man. All right. Thanks a lot, guys. See ya. Bye. Cool, guys. So there you have it. There's your giveaway. And uh, look, it's, it, seriously, if you are just now jumping on and you didn't get any of that information, uh, it's, this is a shorter coach cast. And so make sure you go back and watch that because what Kevin just shared in terms of your tracking sheet, uh, where to find it, the Beachbody Champions page, all of the stuff, you guys, this is one of the most important coach casts that you could go back and watch and maybe rewatch because it's going to give you so many tools about how to stay accountable and really keep going uh, and keeping your 2019 momentum strong. All right. So uh, you've got till next Wednesday to find your accountability buddy, accountability, but accountability, but it's hard to say. I can't imagine spelling it either. So uh, do that. I'll post this on my stories tomorrow. And then, of course, the uh, this whole episode will be posted on YouTube uh, as well. So thank you guys so much. Back next week on the 30th with uh, another amazing uh, coach. And uh, she'll be sharing some awesome tips. With that said, make sure if you don't have a minion shirt, go get a minion shirt. Just because, you know, it's fun to have a cool t-shirt. And uh, you're going to get uh, lots of compliments on it. All right. Have a great night, guys. I will talk to you very soon. Later.